In this video tutorial, I am going to practically show you how to access internet via MicroT router from Cisco Layer 3 switch enter VLAN routing. This video is three part. First part, configure MicroT router for internet access. Second part, after configure enter routing VLAN in Cisco Layer 3 switch. Third part, after configuration, we take two laptop and connection to switch different VLAN port and put IP after that browse internet. First I log in our router. Then we assign port. Port ether one for ISP. And port ether two for our office villain. In port number 3, we connect our laptop for accessing the IQT router. It's not necessary for your configuration. Now we assign IP on our interface. In interface 1 ISP, I assign IP 172.16.10.10 16. This IP I get from my ISP. And it had two office land bridge, office land, we assign IP two office land, office land, we assign IP 10.10.1 of the 30. 30. Now we assign DNS. That's our local ISP DNS, and another is Google DNS. Now we assign default gateway, that's our ISP default gateway. Default gateway, that's our ISP default gateway. Now we configuring that. Change for subjects, next one must do it. Apply and OK. Now we test from my PC and assign by another series IP on 30 series block 10.10.2 subnet mask 255.255.255.252. Gateway here 10.10.10 .10 .10 .10 .10 1. It's a test pur purpose, not necessary. Our MyGoody router configuration is okay. Now we configure our switch using PuTTY. Here is initial direct box, we don't know. 
then hit enter. Fast week. Configure a host name. Our switch host name is code. So that command here host name is space code. Now we configure VLAN 10. Its name IT. And at a time we assign IP in VLAN 10. For VLAN 10 IP is 192.168.10.1.75.255.255.0 Then no chart. For that live up the interface or VLAN 10. Now we configure VLAN 20 name HR and at a time we put IP address VLAN 10 IP VLAN VLAN 20 IP is 192 dot 168.20.1 then no shot exit from here now we assign interface in VLAN 10 for that we enter uh, interface now 1, 2, uh, 46. We declare the interface as an access port. Now we enter interface 1, 2, 24. The interface we re enter interface 1, 2, 24. The interface we declare access to VLAN 10. Now we enter interface 25 to uh, 46. We declare this interface as VLAN 20. Now we save from here so that from here do WR. Now we enter interface now 47. Declare the port as a no switch port. No switch port means this port act as a router port. After that, we assign IP address for. that 10.10.10.2 which I already assign our PC for test purpose in this uh, switch port for test purpose in this uh, switch port we assign this IP as a permanent then no shutdown if it is purpose we remove this IP from your PC or laptop. Now we enter interface now 48 and declare the port as a trunk port. Trunk port means this port you use to connect for another switch.
the stand port allowed million 10 and 20 say from here for that one do double work now we show all interface status now we show all interface status here VLAN 10 and VLAN 20 IP address and now we show uh, port number 47 IP address VLAN 10 and VLAN 20 is a logical port and 47 is a physical port Now configure inter VLAN routing for that command IP routing. Now we default route to the MyGotic router. For that command IP route, then 0.0.0, .0, .0 then 0.0.0, .0, .0, .0, then MyGotic router interface IP 10.10.10.1. Then set the configuration. Now we assign IP on million ten series IP and gateway is. VLAN 10 We already assign VLAN 11 series IP on another side PC. Now we pin VLAN 11 series PC. Sorry, VLAN 10, VLAN 20, VLAN 20, VLAN 20. Now static route to VLAN 10 and VLAN 20 from my getting router. Home my getting router. First IP is VLAN 10 and second IP is VLAN 20. Our all configuration is okay. Now time to test. Now we show our routing status in my computer. So come on here IP route print. You can see also on graphical interface on my computer routers. Routes.
Now check our PC to browse internet. Thanks for watching this video. If you think this video helpful, please subscribe my channel.